we are talking about the relationship between talent, passion, and success. That is your success in life. All the over 8 billion people in this world fall under these four categories. And you, the one watching me, you are under one of these categories. By the time we would have finished watching this video, you will know exactly which one you fall on. So the first category we are talking about is the person who has no talent and no passion. And that person is what we call an unsuccessful person. An unsuccessful person. Yeah. So the person who doesn't, he has no talent and he does not also have passion for whatever work he or she is doing. That person will be an unsuccessful person. And these are the lowest class of people in the society. That is the people who don't even know the meaning of their existence, why they are even on this planet. Then um, we have the second category. The second category are the people that are, they have talent, but they have no passion for whatever they are doing. So anyone who knows, who has the talent in something, but doesn't have the passion, in other words, he doesn't have the energy that will drive him to execute whatever God has put in him. Such a person will become what we call an average person, an average, an average person. Yeah, such a person will become an average person. So this type of person, he has a talent, but that talent is not developed. He does not have the passion for it. So at the end of the day, there are people who have gone to school to study a certain course they didn't have passion for. And so they don't have the energy or they are working in a certain area they don't have talent for. So they will not have the energy to actually do it the way they are supposed to do it. Then we go to the next person, uh, the next category. The next category, which is the third one, is the person who does not have talent but has passion for what he is doing. Yes, we have people like that. Maybe probably the person is not a lawyer or the person has not been trained as a lawyer. But you see such kind of person, any time they are talking about law, you see that the person is happily quoting the law and saying a lot of things about the law. Probably there are two ways I can talk about it. It could be that the person has a talent but didn't discover it early or didn't develop it. But in most cases, probably the person doesn't even, does not have the talent, but he has the passion. He likes the subject matter. He wants to be in that area, but he does not have the talent for it. So such kind of person will become a successful person. Because the, the passion will push him if the person decides to go and study law, though probably God didn't give him the, the, the gift of that law, but his passion will be able to move him to be able to study the law to an end. That, the law is just an example. Several other careers in life, the person will be able to push through to the end. Now, the last category of people that we have are the, those that have the talent and they have the passion for what they are doing. They fall under the category we call a successful person. Super successful person. So these are the Elon Musk, these are the Jeff Bezos, these are the highest class of people in the society. People who have really discovered their talent, they have a passion for what they are doing. They are really doing what God has telling them to come and do. In fact, that was the original purpose of God in creating man. He wants all of us to discover our talent and our passion. But I tell you that these people form less than 10% of the population. And these people form over 50% of the population. The remaining 40% in between these two uh, guys, these two categories. So I'm asking you, the one watching me, which category do you fall under? Do you fall under one, two, three, or four? Leave that in the comment section. Let me know. If you are also the type that hasn't discovered your life purpose yet, and you think you are interested in learning to know who you are, I have a powerful book, Achieving Your Greatest Dreams. It is a book that will help you to discover your purpose in life. In fact, chapter one of this book is discovering the, the, the purpose of your life and the meaning of human existence on this planet. 
and it's a powerful tool. If you are also interested in this interactive Bible screen, you can contact me by following the link in the comment section or the description of this video, and then you'll get a copy. Thank you once again, and see you in the next video. Remember to like, subscribe, and turn on the notification bell.